Post is helping shift a high school automotive program into high gear. The post came from an Ocean Springs student who said hands-on class was stalled and needed engines and other car parts. Destiny Polster takes us to the shop to hear from students who are eager to learn. Automotive service technology is not a class you take to sit and only read a textbook. A good majority of the time, we're doing brake jobs, we're doing audio systems, we're doing simple stuff that you can really do at home, but it's nice to be able to do it in a shop surrounding with all these tools and people to help you. For several years, the tools and students were idle because the students could only work on cars no one drove or spare engines. But spare parts were in short supply. It is an amazing program. It is sometimes overlooked. It's not thought about. Megan Weathers took to Facebook hoping to find engines, motors, and other car parts for class lessons. And I've had a lot of positive feedback about it. I've had a lot of people message me privately asking if they could bring in their own vehicles, have some work done, and pick it up later back on. A new policy now allows students to work on cars owned by teachers and staff. The program has always accepted donations. I love that the students advocated for their program. That's something that we definitely um, is, would we'd like for them to do. So, um, so yeah, she was just real passionate, and we kind of appreciate it because it got the it got the ball rolling on getting some more donations and community help. Megan's Facebook post received hundreds of comments and is generating plenty of offers. I'm just glad that there are so many people in Ocean Springs willing to help this program become something better. CTE director April Engel cautions that donations cannot be dropped off at the high school shop. The school can only accept items that fit with the curriculum. So just contact me, reach out to me in my email, and I will start the process. There's some paperwork to do. It has to be board approved, and then we can make arrangements to get the, the equipment here. The students are ready to get their hands dirty. And I'm just hoping that with the opportunity to have more projects in this shop, it's going to just kind of grow this into something that we always wanted it to be. In Ocean Springs, Destiny Polster, WLOX News Now.